and this is where it all starts here in the Jawa. It's olive picking. This is a little tiny olive grove, and uh, the man is going up the tree and he's going to take down the olives. He's doing it this way by hand. Sometimes they get sticks and they beat the tree basically to death, so all the olives fall off, and then they come down and they land on a blanket underneath. The blanket's there basically to make the job and life much, much easier. And they come down and they land on that blanket. Then once he's picked the olives, they're all ready to go, to be crushed and to be made into olive oil. And here we are, this is way in. They will weigh the olives before they put them into the crusher. Nice bag of olives there. This is the crusher, it's a stone crusher. It goes round and round and it crushes all the olive into a pulp and you can see the pulp is just coming out now. That's the pulp in the, in the little uh, square box. And the pulp is put into these tire shaped uh, things and he pushes them inside these tires, one on top of the other, and then they get ready to be crushed. This is just pulp, olive pulp, squashed olives. This is just finished, this has just been squashed. So the oil has been squashed out of these and they're getting ready to put a brand new one in. There's a new one being put into place. That's put in the press and the press will squash it and it will squash out all of the oil. Then there is pulp left. If you look in the background, you can see a big pile of pulp. And they throw these back onto the pile and they empty them out and then they're ready to be used all over again. Jesus was in Gethsemane, and Gethsemane means olive press. He was pressed, and he was crushed, and he was squeezed, and he poured out his blood. And now we see here the olive oil being poured, poured out. It's a very, very good analogy of what Jesus went through and the olive press. Fresh olive oil, ready to drink. <laughs> 